Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Economic Times, an Indian daily newspaper focusing on business news, reports that Russia has informed India of its commitment to deliver the final two squadrons of the S-400 long-range air defense missile system by August 2026. This adjusted schedule allows Russia to prioritize the needs of its armed forces currently involved in the conflict in Ukraine. India has been in the process of procuring the Russian S-400 Triumph air defense missile system, renowned as one of the most advanced air defense systems globally. The agreement between Russia and India for the S-400 systems was officially signed in October 2018, despite warnings from the United States regarding potential sanctions under its Countering America's Adversaries Through Sanctions Act, COTSA. Valued at over $5 billion, this deal marked a significant milestone in defense cooperation between Russia and India. Delivery of the S-400 systems to India commenced in December 2021, as per the agreed-upon schedule between the two countries. The Indian Air Force, IAF, began receiving the systems and components of the S-400, with the deployment of the initial units expected to significantly bolster India's air defense capabilities, particularly along its borders. India's acquisition of the S-400 system is part of broader efforts to modernize its military capabilities amidst escalating regional tensions, particularly with neighboring Pakistan and China. Capable of engaging aircraft, UAVs, ballistic, and cruise missiles within a range of up to 400 kilometers, the S-400 system offers a substantial enhancement in air defense capability for India. Given the mounting tensions with China, India's investment in air defense has become pivotal in its national security strategy. The complex dynamics of India-China relations, marked by historical conflicts and contemporary territorial disputes, highlight the necessity for India to maintain a vigilant and robust air defense posture. The Line of Actual Control, LAC, serving as a de facto border between the two nuclear-armed neighbors, has witnessed military standoffs and skirmishes, particularly in recent years. This contested border, spanning challenging terrain and strategic locations, necessitates a sophisticated and layered air defense system capable of deterring potential threats and safeguarding national sovereignty. In the modern battlefield characterized by rapid technological advancements and multidimensional warfare tactics, air superiority is of paramount importance. India faces a spectrum of threats ranging from manned aircraft and drones to ballistic and cruise missiles, requiring a comprehensive and advanced air defense infrastructure. The acquisition of systems like the Russian S-400 Triumph Air Defense Missile System underscores India's commitment to enhancing its air defense capabilities. These systems not only multiply defensive capabilities but also serve as strategic deterrents, signaling India's readiness to protect its airspace and counter any aggression. In the context of the unfolding conflict in Ukraine, Russia's focus on maintaining advanced defense capabilities, including the deployment of the S-400 Air Defense System, holds significant implications. This strategic consideration reflects not only the immediate tactical requirements of the war but also broader geopolitical considerations. Renowned for its ability to target various aerial threats over considerable distances, the S-400 system plays a dual role in safeguarding Russian assets and acting as a potent deterrent. The significance of air defense capabilities, particularly in light of the Ukraine conflict, extends beyond the immediate battlefield. For Russia, systems like the S-400 are essential in asserting aerial dominance and shielding against potential airstrikes or reconnaissance efforts by adversaries. This is especially pertinent given the support Ukraine has received from Western nations, including advanced weapon systems and intelligence. The deployment of the S-400 serves as a strategic move to neutralize these advantages and assert control over the airspace. Moreover, the conflict underscores the importance of air defense in modern warfare, where drones, cruise missiles, and other aerial assets are prevalent. The S-400 system, with its advanced radar and missile capabilities, is well suited to counter these threats, providing a critical layer of defense against various aerial attacks. Its deployment in the conflict zone not only serves a defensive purpose but also acts as a strategic deterrent, complicating the calculus for any direct military intervention by NATO or other forces. While detailed open-source reports on the operational use of the S-400 in the current conflict in Ukraine are lacking, its presence underscores Russia's commitment to maintaining a robust defensive posture. It reflects a broader strategy to safeguard key assets and positions, leveraging Russia's advanced military technology as a tool of geopolitical influence. The role of the S-400 in the conflict thus goes beyond tactical contributions, embodying Russia's approach to warfare and defense in the 21st century. That's all for now. See you later.